Okay, um, I'm exploring big ideas. Still haven't come up with my certain idea. Found myself today. Um, kind of cliche, but making my inspiration and most of my art reflects that. So. We're going to take a walk through the woods and see if I can find more inspiration or come up with more ideas. Hello. Um, so I'm working on my page two and one of my big idea book. My big idea is coping. So for visual representation, I've been thinking about ways to represent coping mechanisms, how to define coping visually. So my main thought process was how to add multiple coping mechanisms and maintain unity. So I'm thinking about this process as I'm crafting this little makeshift needle to represent drug use. Um, I started off just stitching the needle and I'm going to fold it and tuck it under so it becomes three-dimensional. Um, I've yet to find out how I'm going to create unity in this piece with the nature and then the random objects such as food, drugs, smoking, cigarettes, um, listening to music and nature, and then creating art. Those are the coping mechanisms I'll use. So here I'm just trying to figure out how to put the layout. <laughs> okay, here I'm playing with the idea of eating as a coping me mechanism. So I decided to use this handmade paper and my plan is to stitch in this donut. I'm going to add some more tissue paper underneath the donut to give it dimension and then decorate it like a donut and try and make it work in my piece with unity. Here I am working on my definition page. So I was kind of interested in working with the new technique. What I did was draw out words with the glue stick and then lay gold flakes over top and rubbed it out. This is how it turned out. I had to do it quite a few times to get it look to look good, but it's very fun.